Hi, we're North Lane at Big D Out 2014 and we're with the AU Review. Really good, really good. We uh, played uh, Gold Coast about four or five days ago now. Um, so this is the second show here in Melbourne for Big Day Out Tour. First one went really well. It was, it was a stinker up in uh, Gold Coast. It was really Real hot. hot. Really, really hot. But all the kids came out in full force. A lot of our fans were at our stage. And uh, obviously, we're, we're, we're a bit more of a heavy act on this tour. We're probably the heaviest one out of all the bands. So we're a bit out of our water, but, you know, we're confident. And, uh, you know, we've been surprised that a lot of our fans are actually here at these shows. And uh, we've been getting a good response nonetheless, for sure. Fair enough. And, uh, you know, what does it mean to be a part of part of Big Down? That must have been on the bucket list. Yeah, for yeah, sure. Definitely. It's legendary. Yeah, it's... Uh, that, along with um, other big festivals like Soundwave, is something that I'm, I'm sure every aspiring Australian band is trying to be a part of, and it's uh, definitely a dream come true for us. Yeah. And uh, we're very thankful to Big Day Out for giving us the opportunity to play. We can definitely tick it off the bucket list. <laughs> <laughs> now Sydney falls on the same day as the Hottest 100. Any predictions? What do you What do you think is going to get up the top there? Wow. Well, I think I think Vance Joy is going to get get pretty close. Vance so Joy will, will, will be up there. He's um, um, we're, we're on the same label as, as that artist. He's doing very well. Been uh, hearing very good things. Um, other than that, I don't really have a clue. I can bring me the Horizon might be up bring there as Horizon. well. Yeah, you know, who knows where they'll be. They've been surprising a lot of people. Definitely. But, um, Carnival will probably be up there as Carnival. well, I'm expecting. Uh, who knows, really? A lot of pop artists will be in a the mix as well. Artists. Beyonce released a new record that's absolutely amazing as well. It's got, got video clips for it and everything like that. I think it'll be a, a surprising mix, I reckon. Yeah, definitely. And for you guys, what's the rest of the year holding? Well, after this, we have a tour in the States. We're doing sort of a split tour. Half of it's with a uh, UK band, Bring Me the Horizon. They're very big shows. Um, a lot of them have been selling out. Uh, and then we have about a dozen or so of our own headlining shows that we're going to be doing on mainly the west coast of the states, um, which is going to be fun as well. Uh, straight after that, I think we have maybe two days in between that and our European tour, so we'll be going through transit, um, catching planes to get to Europe to tour with Architects and Straight From The Path, which will be going right through March into April. And uh, after that, I think we've uh, allocated some time off for the rest of the year as well, maybe to uh, do some writing, hopefully, and uh, obviously spend time with the loved ones as well. Fantastic. Well, it sounds like a big year ahead. I hope you enjoy the rest of the uh, rest of the shows and a uh, big day out. Anyone you're going to try and see today? Uh, I'm going to be watching Deftones every night on this tour <laughs> and probably catch Flume as well. I want to catch uh, Snoop Dogg, a.k.a. Snoop Lion as well. Uh, yeah, right. Tame Impala, I watched them play in Gold Coast. That was great yeah, as well. Playing right now. Yes, I heard. No, I heard them playing before. Yeah. They might be finished now, which but. sucks. But we have the rest of the tour to, to, to catch them. And yeah, there's a lot of great artists to see on this tour. So come check it out.